What's up, everyone? Alex here, and uh, we're we're back. Welcome back to Game Changer. Uh, this is where we explore weird and awesome ways to play games. Uh, Mario's asleep. Get up. Wake up. We got a thing to do. So this is my re-recording of this. Don't tell anybody though, and luckily there'll be no evidence of it actually happening because no no one will know as long as you don't tell anybody. We're checking out some weird stuff that I can enable in the cheat manager for Mario Sunshine and part of that is the test room for Mario Sunshine and it's got pretty much a little bit of everything they had those red coins uh there's this weird log that like there are water physics placed here on the floor but yeah I know about the wall jump friendo are you gonna shut up if I wait what if I Okay, that I can't like skip your dialogue. So yeah, this is basically like it gives you a little bit of everything to play around with. Uh, this is a way to test out Mario's physics for the game. Um, and I'm just assuming this was I'm like leaning too far forward. <laughs> um, and I'm assuming that uh, this was like indus industry standard, like the developers use this and, and all that. Okay, well, just uh, buy soccer ball. That, that flew into the void. Uh, there's some random, like, so I can't, I can't get the paint off the floor for some reason. Like, the water doesn't remove the paint, but it does remove the flames that are in random locations here. Um, it doesn't give me anything, but it, it's something to, to check out. Oh, the soccer ball's back. Sweet. I can't pick it up, but I can kick it around a bit. Yeah, okay. Um, there's like coins to collect. There is a shine sprite. Um, I just have to remember not to save because this is my my like regular save file. Th this is the save file for my one-handed Mario run, so I gotta make sure I don't like save anything while I'm doing this. Uh, we have some not working doors. Uh, they didn't implement that, I guess. Or maybe this is only like the unfinished test room. Uh, something of the sort. I, I can break that. There's like different like holes and there's different ramps and stairs. It's it's testing out how Mario reacts with the environment and with different kinds of environment. So on the other side of this big staircase thing that I was just messing around with, where's the camera? Okay. <laughs> I don't want another issue with the camera right now. Come on. Uh, so there's a, there's a ramp here. I just tried to do the long jump. Mario doesn't have a long jump in this one. Um, but yeah, this, this tests out at what point Mario starts sliding down something because it's too steep. Uh, which, I mean, that's not too bad. Look how far I could walk up before he, before he starts sliding. I, I don't know if they ended up changing that. I don't know if that's actually what the limit is, because that seems very steep. Uh, we've got a rain cloud, which I forgot if you, uh, water them, they get bigger, I guess. Um... And I saw these things over here. I wanted to try to land on them. Uh, this tests out the bungee cords that you can jump on. Um, we have this snack cart thing here. And uh, it just lets you bounce on it. I don't remember there being a, 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 like, is that ice cream? Yeah, it's an ice cream cart. I don't remember anything like that in the overworld or anything. But there are awnings that you can jump on and bounce on. So I guess that's where that's coming from. I... The paint thing is so weird. I can't, like, I can't remove any of that. But it's got, like, lines in it, and it's got markings as if, like, it had already been washed away. I, that's, that's weird. But we have this Noki, um, which is one of the characters from Noki Bay. And you can wash him off, and he doesn't have a shell. I don't know if that wasn't implemented. Um, since it is an emulator, because that's the only way that I could, uh, do a lot of this stuff, it might be that that's an old model for his shell, and it's not implemented into the regular game, but it's part of the test room, and maybe, like, maybe that's just not part of the files that come with the, with the emulator, with the ROM, rather. Um, that's, that's my only assumption. Um, I can collect this. I'm still being told to wall jump. I don't want to wall jump. I actually want to get into the other cheats in the cheat manager because that's how I'm doing it. Um, I do not want to save. I do not want to have to recollect those. And then, of course, it shows up transparent as if uh, 
well, translucent, I guess. Um, as, like, as if I had already collected it, which is sort of cool. I accidentally opened up the map, and, uh, there's nothing here. There's no... It, it treats it like a brand new save file, because the, the test room opens up before you even select a game file. So that's why you can save over your your progress with the with the new shine sprite. Uh, there are there are piantas other than the one I talked to um, down here, but I th like the way they're walking around. This first of all, this one is so brightly colored. I don't think there are any that look like that. But they're walking back and forth, and I thought maybe they would like throw me out of the pit here, but they don't. <laughs> they don't do anything. It's just all error messages. So. Um, I don't know if that's part of the test room, like, there's no, there's no message that was set for those characters, or if, like, maybe it's just, like, the, maybe it's the emulator that can't load it. I don't actually know. Um, yeah, everything just kind of loads back in after I collect that shine sprite. Okay, we're back into it. Um, I am on... So, when you open up the Dolphin emulator, this thing stays open, which is a list of all the games that you have. And it's it's separate from the gameplay screen, which is not typical of uh, an emulator. Usually, usually you can do everything within the game screen, but this one's separate. I think that's kind of interesting. So, I went to Cheat Manager, and we have a ton of beautiful, beautiful cheats that we can play around with. Um... So there's like the infinite whatevers, I don't care for that, but we've got like the super jump, the low gravity. Jesus mode, walk on water, d-pad up and down. Nozzle modifier, I never actually saw that. And also I'm gonna enable the, uh, the, the large Mario code, which, uh, isn't as fascinating as I, I thought it was when I first tried it out. Wake up, we've got some weird things, um... So what was the nozzle modifier about? Is that... No, nothing... Nothing's happening. Oh god. Oh, I forgot I have the low gravity. <laughs> so I have a, not only the super jump, but low gravity. So he can, like, float everywhere. Whee! This one's my favorite. Whoa! The problem with this is, uh... If I fall, then I end up getting hurt. Which I think is hilarious. Also, really interesting thing here, um, that, that's a good way to recover from a, a jump like that, but interesting thing that I learned here is that if I hit the B button, he's got like a, like normally you hit the B button and you just kind of like, you just kind of do that jump like this, but he's got an extra little animation, look at that, like he's diving, I never get to see that because I don't ever spend that long in the air when I hit the B button like that. Um, I did not mean to end up way over here. Can I still... Yeah, I can still jump out of the water. But, uh, yeah, that that's that's the low gravity and the super jump. We Okay, let's see what else there is. Whoa, Jesus. Oh my god. <laughs> that is weird. But yeah, it's, kind of, it's almost like a little slow motion thing, and you get to see how all the little animations... Like, the full version of all the animations... Whoa! Um, so apparently I can apply these and then just go right back into playing and I don't even have to exit out of here. Um, I want the Jesus mode. Oh no, it's not sported. I forgot about that. Uh, don't have to move before triple jump. That's kind of self-explanatory. That's that's how the wing cap works in Mario 64. Oh, what about the... There's one that has like a bunch of weird like colors and stuff. There it is. Insane heat waves. Okay, check this out. Oh, I gotta apply them. <laughs> Okay, whoa, it happens immediately. Whoa. Oh. Double, oh, double heat waves. Whoa, jeez. Okay, well, this is the trippy mode. And, oh, I forgot I still have the uh, low gravity thing on. I need to get that off. Where, where is that? Um, and I also don't need the super jump right now. Okay. I, I like that they, they apply the cheats right away, but oh my god. So you can play like this, I guess. It's not too difficult. Like, it's kind of easy to figure out, like, where Mario is. I turned that off. What are you doing? I am diving. I'm going to go into the water now. Oh, yeah. I forgot that this takes you up very high. The <laughs> the camera doesn't even follow you. Oh, there we go. Okay. I don't think he gets hurt. 
Oh my god. I could just go ridiculously high and then I could do this. And now I'm up here. Whoa. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Head first into the cement. Okay. Oh, and also Big Mario. That's Big Mario. I can flip between Big Mario and Little Mario. That That's literally it. And he doesn't actually shrink. It's just Big Mario, Little Mario. That That's the only way it works. Which is... Ugh. I guess that's what, that's all you get. He's just stretched out. And because he's just a distorted version of Mario, the hitbox is still, like, the hitbox grows with him. It, it's different than the, the big Mario glitch from Mario 64. Uh, which I guess is cool. Like, everything works as normal. He He's just bigger. Strangely distorted people. I tried this last time, and it's literally just this. It's just people are stretched out. Which is hilarious because it, like, if you look, where is it? Uh, oh god, I can't see. If you look, it looks like it's only Mario's overalls and his hat that are walking. <laughs> it's like that with everybody. It looks like they just lost their clothes. Look at that. Ugh. That, that's creepy. Is that happening over here too? It's kind of hard to tell. Oh, you're both naked. Okay. Well, everybody look away. Um, I don't know if that'll turn off if I... Like, if I do this. Um, magnify camera. I don't remember what that does. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh. Mario! <laughs> what? Oh, no. Oh, no. What did I do? Look at his arms! I have... I've never tried that one. Oh, my God. Look at his disgusting arms. It won't, um, it won't apply the, like, it won't take off the other glitches. What if I, well, there's no, like, exiting. I can't see. I can't see. Everything is so, so wonky. Let me restart this and see if I could just have the magnified one. I, I want to see what that looks like. <laughs> oh my god, oh no. Okay, it just, oh boy. It affects the uh, the start menu, but that's okay. Like the like pick your choose your level thing. Uh, what's with the cannon? Look at the cannon. The cannon's like all moved over. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> there you go. Oh wow, that's funny. There's a shine sprite right there, but I think that's part of. I thought that was part of the building. Is it not? No, I don't want to collect that. No, I get. I think this is the building. Yeah, it is. Okay, it the okay the building just kind of moved. That's weird. Everything's like off. The these coconuts are just randomly here. Oh, <laughs> okay. I've got I've got my coconut. I think other objects are supposed to uh, are supposed to like get bigger, but I don't think it's working. This is similar to a glitch that happens in uh, Chaos Edition, where things just randomly kind of get bigger um see some of the hitboxes are messed up like there's something here that isn't supposed to be here what the fuck okay uh, okay i'm in here now oh my god oh i love it okay let's let's get out of there because i'm i'm being I'm, I'm getting freaked out a little oh that's weird and it, it's just his head and his arms ah oh. What is, what is happening with this? Where is the cover to this? This lady's in the ground. I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't mean for this to happen. Yeah, some of the buildings are... I think the buildings are supposed to be bigger, but only... Like, there's only evidence of it in so few places. Like, there's like an invisible wall here. That I think that's that building that I'm looking at right now. And the sign is extended outward, but the building itself didn't extend. That's weird. It's interesting. I'm trying to get on this, but I can't see. I, f I fell. I fell. Oh, is that part of the magnified camera? Like, whoa, what? Um, what? What the fuck? That's weird. Like, there are some places where I can walk like normal, and then other places are like broken. Okay, so I I guess everything is extended. It's just glitchy. So where I'm stopping here, that's actually that wall that I'm looking at. That's in the foreground there. 
Yeah, so that if I jump up, that's me jumping up off the beach. Everything's just moved over a little bit. That's that's so weird. I I don't know what to think of that. Oh my god. I'm like scared to get in the water. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. No, okay. I think yeah, right here I'm I'm in the water. Oh my god. I'm in the water, but only kind of. Okay. Well, I'm glad I re-recorded this because there's a lot of uh a lot of new things that are just too goddamn weird. Um, and I think I can jump at the level from, like, a distance. Where is the... Uh-oh. Like, here? I don't know how to get into this level with this, uh, cheat enabled. Can I get in like that? Oh my god, I can! <laughs> oh my god. That's great. Oh. Sure, I'll take it. I have no idea what's happening. I got the big arms. Here I go. Me and my big arms. Oh my god. So that that's pretty much it. Other than that, there's like random invisible stuff. Oh, wow. Anyway, if you want to try out any of these cheats for yourself, it's, it's literally built into the emulator. So just go to the cheat manager and you can enable cheats. Uh, anyway, check out more of our Gamecast stuff. We've got news, we've got podcasts, podcasts, plural, we, we, <laughs> we've got reviews, I'm so tired. We do have Let's Plays, go go check it out, we've got all kinds of fun things. I'm just going to mess around more in this and then I'm going to call it a day. Signing off for now, see you later. <laughs>